Hey guys, welcome back to some brand new Ark Ragnarok. We're heading over to a spot over here where there's usually quite a few Rexes. I actually have been looking for them today and I haven't actually found any so far. Well, I, I didn't check over here yet, but I've already checked over in the winter biome slash that area with a bunch of dinosaur bones and stuff. So, kind of sucks I haven't found any yet. Hopefully there's some decent levels over here. I was hoping that maybe we could find something over there and then maybe try to look over here for another decent level. So now we have to only look here because there is none on the other spot, which really sucks. All right, let me see. I can see one right here. No, that's an Allosaurus, isn't it? My god, those things look massive. Anyway, guys, we are, uh, we're going to do some Rex taming today, as you probably guessed. And we're obviously going to need the Rexes eventually here for the boss arenas. Uh, is there any Rexes at all? I don't see any. Where the hell are all them Rexes at? Got to be over here somewhere, right? But yeah, we're going to need these guys for the boss arenas. Uh, obviously, yes, we're not going to rush to the boss arenas, but, you know, I kind of want to prep for them because I think it looks really cool. Um, I don't know why I, say, I keep saying arenas when it's just one arena. Uh, it's just a giant arena. We showed it off last week uh, in a video separate to the series. Uh, just on a single player world because that was the easiest way. Uh, those are aloes again. Where the hell are all the rexes at, dude? What the hell? Anyway, uh, yeah, so we want to do that arena eventually, obviously, with some other guys. So I wanted to kind of maybe get into some rex breeding. Plus, I wanted to tame a rex for a little while now, so thought maybe we could do that now. Uh, let me see. I don't see any at all. Huh, what the hell's happening? Where the hell are all the rexes at? There's, like, none. Usually there's, like, a bunch of them over here. This is weird. I haven't found any at all today. Hmm. Maybe, I don't know, maybe there's like a huge bunch of something around somewhere on the map that is just kind of causing them to not spawn. Maybe there's like an overcrowding of aloes or something, I don't know. Let me, uh, I kind of slowed down too much there. I don't know, maybe let's take out some aloes or something? I'm not exactly sure where the hell are all these freaking wrecks at. We just killed a galley, that doesn't really help too much. Yeah, we killed an aloe. And we're almost at a stand, but we might be able to get another attack in. There we go. Killed another one. I can land up here. Nice. Alright guys, don't forget to hit that like button if you find yourself enjoying this video. We're gonna go ahead and just snipe this dude. Alright, come here buddy. And you're dead, 114. I mean, aloes are pretty fun too, but uh, I do want rexes. I don't want... I don't really want aloes because I feel like I feel like rexes are a whole lot better for the boss arena. They're tankier, they they're stronger, you know. Like I think they're just more durable as well. Plus the fact that I have a, re a, a I was about to say really good. I was that I was about to say very. I have a very good um the hell a very good uh, rex saddle blueprint that we pulled, which is ascendant, and we have been making a, p a couple of those so far. They are quite expensive on the metal side, so it takes a little while to gather up all that stuff, but I did a bit of a metal run earlier, so I think we're pretty good. I, I mean, we might be able to make a couple of here, but we definitely don't have 20, uh, and also they cost quite a lot of hide too, so I need to be making sure that I'm keeping all of this stuff, all of the hide. Nice. Okay. Anyway, I guess we're going to have a look around and try to see if we can find a freaking Rex. I'm so confused because they're just not here for some reason, so I don't know. Maybe we're just going to like fly around and try to kill some stuff, kind of like clear out some spawns. That might work for a bit. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys back in a little bit. Ooh. Man, I thought this was another Rex. I honestly did for a second. Sometimes the Uteranus is like, it's pretty much the same size, so it's easy to kind of mistake as a Rex from far away when you can't see the fur uh, or the feathers even. But yeah, so there are some really good level Rexes over here. This is usually a spot where you kind of find quite a lot of them, to be honest. And when I came over here earlier, they weren't here at all. Uh, but I did kill an Alpha Raptor, so maybe that had killed them earlier or something? I'm kind of confused. Am I wearing my armor? I am, okay. That kind of confused me there for a second. Let me kill these aloes. We're getting that lighting glitch right now. I'm not really going to change my settings to try to fix that. We're just going to have to deal with it. <laughs> they kill you. Oh, man. Freaking aloes. Get out of here, man. Let's go. And they're all dead almost. Oh, my God. Sometimes you get that strange, like, extra speed boost. It's really weird. 
I don't know how to like describe it. I feel like this is a high level aloe, by the way. Yep, this is definitely a high level aloe. Hey, buddy. And you are not dead, and you're dead. 168. Nice. That would have been a great aloe to tame. And we have another one right here. Holy crap. These things are just everywhere right now. Holy crap. All right. Anyway, we're not going to deal with that guy. We're going to deal with some of these Rexes here. So, uh, down below, I think the green one was the 174. There's a 156 female and a 174 female. And there was another Rex around here, too. Uh, there it is up here. So, this is another 174. Two 174s, which is great. Um, I don't know if we can, like, hold out for some 180s, but, I mean, 174s definitely would be pretty cool. Don't know whether or not I'll tame that 156, though. I mean, like, on Ragnarok, finding high levels on, like, dinos is really not hard to do. I mean, we did an episode last week where I killed, like, four 180s during the episode. So, I don't know. Sometimes you kind of just find a crap ton of, like, really max level creatures. And, I don't know, that could even happen on official. <laughs> so, wow, well, yeah, we're going to tame up these guys then. What are you? Yeah. Oh, this one here is such cool colors, though. Look at that. It's got, like, yellow underbelly. It's got, like, the, uh, I guess it's kind of look like... It kind of looks like a bit of a cyan. We've seen this color before. Um, oh, it's gone all the way down there. But I've seen that color like that before. We tamed a Rex in Season 3 of the Vanilla series uh, that looked just like that. It had that little cyan bit. So, yeah, I think this is the 156, right? Yeah, we're not going to tame this thing. Screw it. I'm going to go ahead and just kill it. Just to get out of the way. Completely messed all that up because I was going down a hill. All right. Let's get this thing going. There it is. Uh, we're also out of stamina. Great. I didn't even realize. I thought we had plenty. Alright. Let me, let me just stop. Do you mind? Stop. <laughs> what the hell? It's like freaking dark and light. That's what happens to dark and light. The E or the griffins just walk forward like that. <laughs> it's so strange. Alright, where the hell is this... Uh, 156 gone. I feel like he's right below me here. There he is. Is he gonna try and come up here? Wondering. There we go. We got him. Nice. Sweet. Okay. So let's go ahead and try to knock out this female. And then we'll go up there and get the mail afterwards. I do have mutton on me, so it's going to be pretty easy to tame these guys. I don't have any kibble, of course, because we don't have any scorpions. Oh, man, this looks like really low graphics right now. And now it's back to high graphics. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't have any uh, kibble for these guys, but mutton will definitely do. Uh, maybe I'll put my, my griffin in a safer spot. Maybe, like, up here. Yeah, this is much better. Alright, so it shouldn't take long to knock out with my uh, with my amazing rifle that we have here. Uh, let me actually go ahead and just do this really quick. So we can kind of like hang off the cliff a little bit and just shoot at it. Nice. Oh man, it's already running? Are you kidding? No way. Seriously? One shot? <laughs> what is it doing? Okay, how did that not hit? What are you doing? Stop, no, 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 don't go into the water. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, are you kidding me? Alright, hang on. <laughs> Let's get the parachutes on here. Uh, is it going into the water? Like, what the hell is it doing? What are you doing? All right, we hit it again. All right, we're just gonna fall down here a little bit. We'll be safe. Ah, oh, come here, buddy. Come on, come back. We want to tame you. Hmm. Doesn't that sound nice? Have a nice home, a nice saddle to wear. Oh, and it's coming.
Come here. I feel like it's gonna get up here. <laughs> I'm not like moving by the way. Like how that lighting glitch is happening every single time I move though. Oh, what the hell? Why is there, no! Why are you attacking me? There's nothing dead here. You ass. <laughs> All right. Come here, buddy. Yo has left the ark. All right. If I stand in the water and shoot, Oh, apparently I can't actually. Yeah, I forgot I can't. <laughs> that was dumb. Alright. If I stand beside the water and shoot, then when it gets uh, a little bit tranked, it's not going to stay in the water. It's going to run onto the land, which is what I want. And it just went out in the freaking water. Damn it, I didn't think it'd be out already. Alright, let me see if it's uh, losing oxygen. Hopefully it's not. I mean, it's like right on the edge. I, I feel like. Oh, yeah, we're good. Nice. Sweet. Okay, so that is a freaking 174 female downed. Drop in some foods. Not sure how many it's going to take. I actually have to look that up. So I'll just drop in that much, I guess, for now. And I, I guess I'll look it up. And then we're going to head up hill and grab that 174 on the hill. And look around as well, because, I mean, like, we could definitely find more females, for sure. Uh, maybe even, like, a 180, possibly. Uh, I mean, like, a 180 male would be the best thing if I could find one of those. But, uh, yeah, I'll just, I'll probably just keep looking for more wrecks as well. These guys tame up, so. Uh, yeah, we'll be back in a minute to get that one. I just want to look up how many, uh, mutton it's going to take. Okay, let's head uphill here. So we are, we're just going to leave that one there. It should be fine by itself. Oh, we, we hit the tail. Nice. All right, let's get up this hill and tame this other one. This one should be a little bit easier to tame because it's not right beside water. Uh, also, it's like right beside a cliff there. Perfect. Nice, we can just stand up on top and uh, shoot it from there. Is that a, is that a horse? Oh, it's a dire wolf. Okay. thought it was a freaking horse or something. I didn't know dire wolves. Uh, I guess it must have fallen. But to say, I didn't know direwolves like spawn down here, but I guess they don't. Uh, hey, buddy. Ah, uh, now you're running away, aren't you? You know what's gonna happen. Oh, God. Get away. No, Griffin, no. We're okay. I don't see any more. Oh. Oh, no, I see them all right. <laughs> All right, you can stay up there. I think you're kind of fine there. Holy crap, that's really cool, actually, the way he's just sitting up there. Uh, where the hell's the Rex? Okay, there he is. Nice. Okay, come here, buddy. Oh, is he hurt? Oh, he's kind of hurt, actually. What's he fighting? Is that an RG? Let me... Oh, he's got freaking things on him. What are they called? Uh, vultures. Get off of him, man. Got one. That was a good shot, actually. I think he got that one, did he? Yeah, no. I, I thought he was a little bit bloody, but he's not. Okay. Ah, oh, that should have hit. All right, screw this. Oh, I can't see him. <laughs> All right. Ooh. All right, come here, buddy. Get a couple shots off here, and my rifle's not reloading. It's great, thanks. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, we should be able to get a couple more before he starts to come to me. Just hold still, buddy. Yay. What is he fighting, actually? I need to kill whatever that is. Nice. Okay. Come here. No, stop fighting stuff. Damn it. Oh my god. 
<laughs> he doesn't he doesn't want to just like sit still and get hit all right like come to me or something I've been shooting you and killing your prey come to me come on there you go that's good enough at least I know you're on your way that one hit I saw that hit but apparently I didn't get a hit marker that's great Client side. Server side? No. Stop. Oh my god. How's that? Oh, it's another Rex. What level are you? Ugh, only level 66. Damn, could you imagine if that was like a, another 174 or like a 180 or something? Uh, oh, he's going down towards the other one, actually. That's a little bit handier. I like this. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's go this way, buddy. Oh, that was a bad shot. Oh, no, maybe it wasn't. Uh, that was not a bad shot. As you can see, that was a great shot. And I hit him. Alright. So it should take around... Um... 16 to 20 muttons. So, yeah, we'll just stick in that much. That should be enough. Uh, that other one down there should be fine. I'm not even going to go bother checking. Uh, we're just going to keep going and keep looking for some more Rexes to tame. Because, obviously, you know, like, we could keep, we could tame, like, 20 Rexes, but we might not have great stats on them. So, we want to do a little bit of select selective breeding. And, obviously, with these guys, I'm going to be going for some stat mutations. Trying to get the best stat mutations that I can to try to actually defeat these bosses in an easy enough way. So yeah, that's kind of the plan here, guys. Um, I guess we're going to have to go look for some more Rexes now. And where is my RG? RG? It's a griffin, and also there's a bunch of dire wolves there. That's great. <laughs> Alright, you need to come to me. Come on. By the way, actually, people were asking where to find the aloe vera to get the cactus sap. Uh, you can find it around here, uh... We're like close to the castle. I'm not really gonna bother pulling out a GPS. But like you can kind of figure out where we are from the surroundings here. Anyway, we'll uh we'll see you guys in a little bit if we find another Rex. If not, we'll probably be back with these guys. Well, the age old question, bear or T Rex? Or maybe it was shark and T Rex. Either way, I think the T Rex wins. That was a one seventy four bear versus a one eighty T Rex. And uh, the fact that the T-Rex wins means that we get to tame it. <laughs> We're just gonna go ahead and try to knock out this guy once we kill this uh, Paraceratherium. Nice. Let me let it have a little eat there. Just gonna start hammering this guy with some arrows. I'm actually, or not arrow starts. I'm actually just gonna tank it with the Griffin this time, to be honest, because I know that we can. This thing is actually quite hurt as well, so I must have been doing a lot of fighting. This is actually really close to the base as well, so it's going to be handy to transport back. Come on. Go down already. Anything around us? Not really. Can I reload? Thank you. Oh, what is that? Galley? Okay. Can I reload? Apparently not. Hey, there we go. And it's out. Sweet. Okay, let me chuck this away. Uh, is there anything bad around us here? I don't really see anything. Alright, let's land down here. Just this forest is pretty dangerous, so I don't really want to be on the ground for too long. So we're just going to feed it and let it be. Alright, we're going to keep looking. We found a 180 to 174 as we kill that 156. Um... I mean, I'll settle now. What what we have, I think I'll settle for a 168 at, at max, uh, if we can find one. If not, it's probably okay because I mean we have two females and one male. It's unfortunate that the highest level was not a male though. That would have been a little bit better to start off this breeding with, but it's okay. I think we're still gonna be absolutely fine. So yeah, I I guess we're just gonna have a little peek around. If not, we'll probably just grab our uh, our current Rexes and just bring them back to base, I guess. So, I'll see you guys in a little while.
<laughs> Never gets old. So we're over here with the first Rex that we knocked out. It is fully tamed up. The other one up there is almost awake. I think it has a couple more nibbles to go. Can I kill this vulture? Probably not. Don't really want to waste my time on it. They fly pretty high sometimes. Anyway, let's head up the hill here a little bit. And uh, maybe just try to get a couple levels on this thing. I don't want to actually level up anything right now, though, come to think of it, because if I do, then I won't be able to actually check its stats. Unless I look at it in the video right now. Ooh, the health is actually not... Is that good? I don't think that's great, actually. Hmm, the weight seems pretty good, though. Stamina seems pretty decent as well, actually. Alright, let's, uh, let's wait and see what this other one turns out to be. Are you up yet, buddy? No, he's not. Let's see. Let me hop off really quick. Uh, you guys stay there. No, no, no. Oh, they're following each other. No wonder. Uh, what the hell? No, what's hitting me? No, 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 no. We don't, no, no. Passive. We don't do that. You don't bite near your new mate over here. Oh, hey. <laughs> oh, we didn't even. There we go. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Get off me, stupid vultures. Oh my god. There we go. What the hell am I even on? Am I on his foot? Alright, there we go. Come here. Hey, hey, hey. Alright. Nice. That's a good roar. That's a really good roar. Alright, let's bring all these things back. Um, okay, the health on this one's not great, though. Hmm. The weight is a little bit better than the other one. The stamina is a little bit better. Uh, melee, I'm not really sure yet. We're going to have to check. But uh, I don't know. I don't think the health's great on these things. That kind of sucks. Hopefully the 180 has good health. If it uh, tamed up correctly, that is, anyway. Right, well, we're going to head back to base. Uh, it's going to be a, quite a journey to get across all of this train here in this terrible lighting. So annoying. To be honest, I might just head up the hill and walk across. I think we'll be okay. Can I get up here? I can get up over here. Alright. Oh man. I will see you guys back in a bit when we are over at the base with all of our new Rexes. It's going to be amazing. And it's going to be ages. <laughs> okay guys, so we are back and it's actually the next day and we've tamed a couple more Rexes here. Uh, so I did a little bit of a stat check on our original three, which is this one, this one, and this one. P please excuse the frame, seriously, it's weird for some reason when I have the hood off, it's okay though. But uh, I need to actually be able to see the names. So this one and this one here had kind of average stats, not really like good in anything. I mean, the best thing is probably the health, I'd say. Uh, what's the health in this one again? Uh, yeah, that one's kind of low. So yeah, this one here has decent enough health, uh, but nothing else really shines. Nothing's high. This one here, though, has high melee, which is really interesting. So as you can see, it's 360 right here, and uh, it, also had, it also has high oxygen as well, which is kind of pointless. I don't really need that at all. Um, but the melee is handy. I mean, I'll definitely take that. So then after that, I was like, okay, well, I kind of need like more Rexes to actually broaden you know, like our actual high stats, because we currently we only have high melee, and I tamed three more, and unfortunately the two white ones here are, again, average stats, but this one right here has high melee, and this one actually has higher points in the melee stat than the original Rex that we have over there. So what we're going to need to do is possibly tame up a new male, and hopefully have it with some decent enough stats, um, at least high enough health, I guess, and then... We're going to just breed it with this one, or else we can take this one and this one here, hopefully try to get this higher melee, and breed them together, and then obviously after that, when we get the high melee on a male, we're going to have to breed it with this one here, I think, and then we can combine the high melee with the decent enough health, and obviously this one has decent enough stamina as well, which is kind of what I want, because... I mean, with 2,000 stamina, you're not really going to need to actually pump anything into that at all. Um, I don't really think I would need to at all, so that's really handy, and uh, obviously the weight and everything else here is pretty good, but the melee on that one right there is what we need. So, that's all for another day. We're not going to do any Rex breeding right now because, oh my god, it's going to take ages to try to breed for these stats. 
So I think maybe what we're gonna do is we're gonna head out on our griffin because you guys actually I need to head in here really quick You guys were telling me that Over at the little sunken ruins that we checked out in the last episode uh, The one with the otters and that wasn't the last one that was a couple episodes ago But uh, I'm kind of pre-recording because I'm about to head away. Uh, let me grab flippers as well actually uh, There we go sweet did I grab those? I did, awesome. All right, so you guys were telling me that there's an artifact over at those little uh, sunken ruins that we checked out in the otter taming video a couple videos ago. So let's head over there because I kind of want to grab that artifact. I mean, if it's right over here, it's really close, uh, I should be able to get it. Now, people were telling me that it's hidden in the basement. I didn't even see some sort of basement. So I'm kind of confused. So I thought maybe we'd take a look together because it could be like a hidden little entrance or something like that. I have never actually seen this artifact uh, over at this location. So obviously I don't really know too much, but it's it's like right here. So no point of really taking a cut at all. Um, there's like a lake right here. All right, let's do another one of these. This should get us there. And we are here. Sweet. All right, we're gonna land this guy up on top. I'm gonna try to figure out how to get down to wherever this artifact is. So I brought scuba just in case. Um, all right, you're gonna stay there, buddy. <laughs> right up on top of that thing. All right, uh, let's chuck these on. So I might have to like break a rock or something because some of these artifacts are like hidden in weird ways. There's a Therizino just chilling over there. We'll level you. 71 or 72 even. Interesting. All right, let's head down. Let's have a little look for this hidden entrance. Supposedly it's in the basement. Um, I don't see a stairs down though. Is there like some hidden way back here? Maybe I have to like break a rock. Can I get... It's just a little. No. Can I get back in there that way? No. Uh, I might have to like break a rock or something to get down. Maybe like this thing here? No. Oh, I can hear it. I can hear it back here. Slightly. Thought I heard something there. Oh, right here, look. Oh my god, we completely missed this. Oh man. Is there anything down here? I don't think there is, but... I guess it's on the other side. Wait, no, there's more. Oh, dude, this is a whole big thing. All right, hang on. Wait, is there anything over here? It's just the same? Okay. Hopefully there's nothing in here. Oh, man, look at this. I see it's over there. I just want to check this out. Oh, dude, this is cool. I wish you could find, like, a uh, aged beer or something in here, and it would, like, do something. Got some compost bins there. Interesting. All right, well, here's the artifact, guys. Uh, oh, my God, what the hell? What the hell happened here? Damn it, there's like a bed as well. <laughs> Alright, let me, let me, uh, we're in the water, we can't, we can't eat, so we're gonna have to just wait a second and eat when I get out. Uh, these are the coordinates right here, in case anybody's wondering, for the artifact of the Skylord. Nice. Oh, it's already back. Interesting. Alright, let's get back out of here, because I gotta eat something before I start taking a bunch of damage. So that is, that's kinda cool. I didn't actually know that was down there. Um, so thanks guys for the little bit of a heads up there because I probably would have had to look up the location eventually uh, We do want to go artifact hunting as well pretty soon uh, There are quite a few artifacts on this map and you need quite a few of them for actually doing the boss arenas So it's gonna be kind of crazy because I've heard of where some of them are and one of them's at the bottom of the ocean in a Tuso infested area so that means possible to so taming and also possible more likely death. <laughs> I don't know. That's probably going to happen. We're probably going to die somehow trying to do all that. But uh, yeah, so that's all for another day anyway. We got our artifact. We got our Rexes. We got more Rexes. We have crap Rexes, but it's okay. I'm going to probably keep looking to try to find some decent levels. I'm just killing all the lower levels and anything else that I think might be in their, in their like spawn... Uh, Capper zone or whatever. I don't know spawn group. Is that what they are spawn group? But uh, yeah, I'm gonna like start killing all of pretty much everything that I see that is like large enough like a carnivore or something like that Maybe like aloes and things or I guess I could look up all these spawn groups as well It might be a better idea. So yeah, we'll, we'll do all that We will get some good rexes and then we're gonna start breeding them uh, I don't know if that's gonna be the next episode or the one after or maybe after that, but it's coming up pretty soon 
We do want to try to do this arena eventually, and uh, I'm really excited to do it. So, uh, yeah, we, we gotta get that Rex army going pretty soon. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and beat the crap out of that like button. If you guys want to see more like this, uh, subscribe. That's the best way to keep up with everything. And, uh, as always, I will see you next time.